Hopeless Dreamers video, we're supposed to rant about something, and so, yeah, um, this is gonna sound really mean, but here it goes. Um, two weeks ago, we went to see Rascal Flatts and Van Perry and Cassidy Pope, and I had made a sign that, well, I'll just show you, I'll just insert a picture of it. Um, that I made that sign because of my roommate. Um, probably all know the story, but if not, I'll put a link to the video I made. And I think I think I talked about it in another video. I'll put that link too if I can find it. And uh, I took it in. You know, I held on to it for the whole show. Well, pretty much the whole show. It was the band parade, which was the middle act, and it was towards the end of their set. And when I got time for the, the song and it came on, I like walked forward from my seat. And I held the sign up, and the usher come up behind me and was like, you need to go back to your seat. Okay, so I went back to my seat, kind of disappointed, because the band didn't see it then. And the guy beside me was like, hey, I'll hold it up for you, you know, because you're short. I'm like, okay. And so he held it up, and the usher comes out and goes, you need to put it down. So he put it down, and I'm like, hey, let's go throw it on stage so they can at least see it. I know I won't get it back, but I have pictures of it, and I have a memory, so... I, he went and he's like, I'm stronger than you, I'll go throw it. Okay, so when he threw it, it kind of unrolled itself and flailed out. And it hit some other guy in like the second, first or second row. And that guy unfolded it and held it up. And the band sucked. Well, after the song was over with, I was like, I tapped the guy on the shoulder. I was like, hey, can I have my poster back? He's like, yeah, sure, you only hands it to me. Usher comes up behind me and grabs it. No, she rips it out of my hands. And I'm like, as we're like struggling before she rips it out, I'm like, I'm just gonna go take it to my roommate and have her put it in her backpack. We're gonna fold it up. It's done and over. No, give it to me. She rips it out of my hand. Stand there in shock. And then I start bawling. Because this has meaning to me. And the way it was like rudely ripped away from me. And I come back and the guy's like, well, that was me. And you know, my roommate saw it happening. My roommate's like trying to get there. People moving everywhere. And she gets there. And too late. The usher takes it from me. And I was pissed through the rest of the show, for the rest of that band, and then we left to go meet Cassidy Pope. And um, when we were in line, I caught a security guard and I was like, hey, are we not supposed to have posters? And he's like, no. I go, well, mine was taken away. Can you figure out why? He's like, yeah, sure, I'll go figure out why. You know who the usher was? I go, I don't know, I was an older lady, she was very neat. He was like, where are you set? He's like, only where I was set. And he's like, okay, I'll go figure it out. And so we got up, we met Cassidy and stuff, blah, blah, blah. And then on our way out, <laughs> we couldn't find our way to get back down. We were sitting on the main floor. And um, I asked another security guard, and he like walked the other guy, and the other guy said, well, it was probably because it was either A, offensive, I, don't see, I didn't see anything offensive with it, or people couldn't see. You couldn't see to begin with. You're sitting on the main floor. You're all on the same level. Like, nobody could see. Whatever. He goes, but I can get it back after the show. And I said, well, yeah, I had better be there. Because this is bull crap. And so when I go back to my seat after meeting Cassidy. Oh, before that. Hold on. Before that. Um. We get done, we get done, done with it, talking to the other security guard, and we're, run, we're going down the stairs, and I hear Rascal Flatts come up. And so, I take off running as hard as I can to go get for Rascal Flatts, because it's a good song. And I get there, and I like, as I'm running back to my seat, I run right past that security, right past that uh, usher, and she didn't say a word to me. But you could tell she was mad. And we get back to our seats, blah, 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 and the guy that held it up, first time for me, the nice guy beside me was like, yeah, I went and caught the security and I said you can have it back. You almost got kicked out because of it. And I'm like, you're not the only one that almost got kicked out because I wouldn't give it to him. And so, yeah, after the show, I went and I talked I talked to a security guy by the box office and he was like, well, more than likely it's not there. And I was, and I said, well, it better be there or I'm not coming back ever again. So we had to wait like 10 minutes before the lady at the box office got there. Somebody in front of us had lost their keys. And after that, I asked her, I'm like, she's like, well, what does it have on it? And I pulled her in. She's like, oh, yeah, here it is. I'm like, oh, good, it's here. Because I was not going to be happy if it wasn't. So, yeah. 
that's my rant. Um, let me know in the comments what you think, if I was right or if I did something wrong or just what your opinion is of the whole situation. So, I'll see you guys next week. Bye!